If I drink someone's blood, I can turn into them. Whatever I take in turns into energy, so the more I drink, the longer I can hold on to the form! One cup lets me look and sound like someone for about a day. Plus, if I drink a bunch of different people's blood at the same time, I can turn into any of them! I can recreate their clothes, too. But they get layered under my own, so it helps to get naked before I transform, which can be a little embarrassing sometimes. Cremation. Cremation is an emitter type quirk which first appeared in chapter 74 of the My Hero manga and episode 41 of the anime. This quirk grants its user the ability to produce, generate, and manipulate fire from their body at will. Now, this may sound very similar to Endeavor's Hellflame ability, which I've discussed in a previous video. And if you just look at the base descriptions of these quirks, then yeah, they are practically identical. However, when you take a closer look, there are a couple of key differences between these two quirks. For starters, cremation is much more powerful than Hellflame, with the user being able to produce flames that reach temperatures above that of 2000 degrees Celsius, or 3632 degrees Fahrenheit. To put this into perspective, the temperature of lava, you know, the thing that erupts out of volcanoes and destroys everything in its path, is usually somewhere between 700 and 1200 degrees Celsius. That's right, the flames produced by cremation are nearly twice that of molten lava. But according to some My Hero fans, they are still nowhere near as hot as the Quirk's user. This huge amount of heat is also why Dobby's flames appear blue rather than the stereotypical red, because they are much hotter. Another difference between Hellflame and cremation is that while cremation does seem to provide the user with some form of pyrokinesis, which is the ability to control flames with your mind, it doesn't seem to be at the same level to that of Hellflame. So, while Cremation's flames are far more powerful than Hellflame's, the user has far less control over them. Which makes total sense when you think about it. Endeavor, curious as to how Dobby's body hasn't fully disintegrated under his own heat, realizes the terrifying truth about his son. Dobby also has an ice quirk, which has now awakened due to the stress of this near-death experience. Quirks explain, Hawk's quirk fierce wings grants him a pair of red large wings on his back allowing him to fly. Hawk is able to manipulate every single feather he sends out to either rescue civilians or use them as weapons. Not only that these feathers are incredibly strong, they can also sense vibrations allowing Hawks to decipher conversations and vocal information.